Okay, this is my fail safe on my turbine. Uh, it's controlled by a governor, electronic governor that controls this actuator right here and moves this little arm back and forth. And if the governor were to fail during flight, then basically the engine throttle goes to idle and there is no control. So I've come up with a fail safe. This is what you would do if your engine were to, uh, if the engine governor were to quit, you know, and let the engine just go right to idle, you simply roll in the throttle, and now you have full manual control by moving the throttle twist grip beyond its natural range. So I can go wide open, back to idle. Wide open, back to idle. Normally, right here is where it would be when you're at wide open throttle and the governor is controlling it. And the governor, I don't know if you can see this, but would still have full range of motion going stop to stop, you know, on the governor. If the governor quits, that would move forward. Then you would simply roll in the throttle and you would have control. It might be a little tricky to control the RPM. But I'm thinking that this would be better than just having a full out emergency. If the governor quits, you would be able to manually control the throttle and land the helicopter safely.